Hey guys, Mark 6 here. Uh, I'm going to start with the transport helicopter, flying around with it. And then I will show you the driver's seat, the attack helicopter and the gunner. Um, mainly just to show you how much they've changed. A lot easier to fly now, as you can see right there. How easy it was to just pull up now. It's transport helicopters used to be a right pain. Um, I'd like to talk about some of the changes they've made as well in these helicopters vehicles in game. Uh, the flares take a lot longer to recharge so you gotta be very careful now. Like it's a six but you don't actually have six. So is the attack helicopter then I'd like you to watch the missile count because you use them 14 when you reload but if you use that too quick you have to wait see that little grey bar underneath the ammo there recharging. You've got to wait for it to fill. Now this is really handy because it works on tanks as well and also people spamming. So that's going to be a very, very handy feature. Um, I don't think they use flares in this video but it, it's, it's S6 but the burst it uses all of them once. Uh, also vehicles don't seem to disable anymore. Well they do but um, if it goes red, then your then your health on the vehicle will not recharge after a while. But you don't bleed out from what I can tell you. From what I've played, and I've played for like eight hours, I think. You do not bleed out. So that's quite good. You can always repair yourself then. It's like if you want to disable a tank hope, you hit it in the crevice. It's how you do it now. It's, it's not uh, so much damage, but it's then not. Shit, I can't move. You gotta do damage to the right place. It's really good that it's a lot of times in this episode. Means that we're going to have to put 80 mines in the right places. Trent's great, and stuff like that. Yeah, as you can see, fly through these buildings, it's a lot easier to control as well. There's a new, uh, um, new like, uh, attachment for helicopters, both type, which stabilizes you if you're gonna. I don't do it in this video either. But if you hit a building, you're not just going to blow up anymore. All will happen is you start falling, and you're just like, you'll have to rebalance yourself, and then you can just carry on. You might take a small amount of damage, but like, like that red light will come on, and you can be able to stabilize yourself. Anyway, I'll let you enjoy the rest of the gameplay. Like that. That's what I do. See you next time. Oh, <laughs> oh,